What's up guys, I'm PJ Orlando, class of 2024, committed to South Carolina. I play here at Somerville High School and I play with Gaines National over the summer. This is what's in my bag. What's up everyone? For the month of April, I will be giving away a pair of 100% S3 Tokyo Night Edition sunglasses. They've been out of stock for a long time and I finally got my hands on a pair. All you have to do to win these sunglasses this month is one, be subscribed to the channel, two, like this video, three, comment down below, four, watch this video all the way through to the end, and five, do that for every video that drops in the month of April. Good luck to everyone, and thanks for subscribing to the channel. So first off, we're gonna start with the bats. Um, over the summer, I used wood bats, I use anchor bats. Um, this is my own custom model, it's PJ um, M and it's a 33 and a half, no cup, flare knob, a little bit end loaded, and um, you know, facing a little bit stiffer pitching, it's, you have to make sure that you're super reliable with your bats and make sure they're not breaking, so always go with the no cup and super reliable with anchor bats, and couldn't have wished for any better company with a special family that's owned by it, so. I got this one as well, this is another anchor bat, this is fish scale, um, it's pretty special, this is one of my custom bats that I used in the Homer Derby, Super sick looking bat with the colorways. They did a really good job. Um, my dad, this is my dad's favorite bat, so I had to make sure that I included it in the video. This is my metal bat. I like to switch them around during the high school season, kind of go half and half season, but this is the old reliable. This is a Bone Saber two piece hybrid. Um, 33 and a half. I don't really know what it is about this bat, but it just feels absolutely amazing. The hands, the juice is unreal, um, and there's never an off day with it. You know, if any any person can go up there and, and swing this bat and feel really comfortable with it. So it's a it's a guaranteed gamer. The next bat I got is the OG Red Meta. This bat was almost impossible to find, but I finally got my hands on one. Um, the guy who was selling it was really cool, and I was lucky enough to get it before the season started. So I always switch between this and the Bone Saber. Um, this is a 34 inch bat. I have the PG sticker on it to try to keep it in the best condition I can because after the season, we're gonna have to say goodbye to her. But um, this is an unbelievable bat, stupid juice, and the sweet spot is pretty much the whole bat, so. Now we're gonna get into the Homer Derby bat. I used this over in Seattle during the Homer Derby, and it's just unreal. I mean, this is a, a stupid hot bat, and this is always the reliable when I'm swinging 100 times in five minutes. It's, um, a really hot bat and I, I really recommend the Atlas. Now let's get into some, some things that I carry with me to the field. Um, partnered up with Bruce Bolt and so I always keep a few extra pairs so you never know when you're going to need them um, or hand them out to the kids, you know. I mean Bruce Bolt is just such a, such a great company, they make really good gloves and so all the kids go crazy for them. So I got some, some baby blue ones. These are the new King of Juco ones. I'll open them up for you, give you a little sneak peek. They did a really good job with this one and did a really good collab post with his face on the, on the hand right there. Um, these are beautiful. If you, if you can't get your hands on these, then you're missing out. <laughs> They're awesome. I got, a, I got an extra sliding mitt. Always gotta keep these on deck. You never know when you're sliding into a really rough field and you might rip one, but this is a royal blue color. Um, Bruce Bolt has reliable stuff. I mean, everything is top, top notch. And um, I mean, I really love these things. These are really nice. Um, always make sure they keep your hand protected. Next thing is I keep a hand guard. Um, I think this is one of the most underutilized tools ever. There's so many kids who get hit in the hand and um, just going up to the plate, knowing that your hand's protected, it definitely helps you in the box and keeps you more confident. So Bruce Bolt on top, man. Always got to keep an extra leg guard. Uh, my straps always break for some reason. I have no idea why. They might just get caught on my cleat or something, but always got to keep an extra leg guard. Bruce Bolt does another really good job, and I mean, it's super drip. So if anybody's looking for a leg guard, hit up Bruce Bolt. So next thing going into my bag is I always keep an extra pair of sunglasses. Um, I'm a huge fan of 100%, super loyal to them. They've done a very good job with every single pair of sunglasses that I've owned. Um, this is a, a black and purple lens colorway. Uh, these are super nice, they're super light, and you know, as an outfielder, I couldn't thank them enough because they've saved me plenty of fly balls that I could have missed. Um, this, is, this is the Gamer pair. I've had these for a few years now. These are the white 
with the blue lenses. I mean, they're just so slick. Um, I, they're just my favorite. I have the yellow nose piece. My buddy sent it back because mine were broke and um, he put a new nose piece on there. So shout out to Chris Newstrom, I appreciate it. All right, so now we're gonna get into the, the top compartment of the bag. I got a few Big League Chew. Um, they reached out to me over the, over the summer and we started collabing a little bit. Man, I'm so thankful for this opportunity. It's unreal. This is just a childhood dream of mine and you know, this is, it's just an unreal experience. I get to share the whole team with uh, Big League Chew bubble gum. So I appreciate it guys, thank you. Next is we got my mini compartment of all the goods, all the pine tars, all the tapes. Um, shout out to Kraken, they do an amazing job. Um, this is the pink colorway. Go, go hit them up, small company, turn into big things. Um, it's absolutely incredible, they do a really good job. Next we got the team pine tar, I always keep it on deck. Uh, the Kraken's for my personal use, but the Bruce Bolt pine tar gets the job done for the whole team, so I appreciate it. Next, we got some accessories. Um, this is an arm sleeve, Bruce Bolt, pink. You can't go wrong with the pink colorway. Um, it's super drip, and I don't know, I always rock it for my mom, so it's pretty cool. And then the next thing is we got a Thumb Pro. This thing will save your life. If you don't, if you don't own one of these, I highly recommend it. Um, it's a super under, underutilized tool, and it will get you off the fear of facing pitching machines. Trust me, I promise. The next thing we got is, I'm a redhead, so obviously, obviously I have to have the sunscreen on deck. Um, thanks mom for giving me red hair, but you know, we always try to do the best thing we can to protect the skin, um, so yeah. Next thing we got is just some Tiger Balm. Uh, you can't go wrong with it. I picked it up from Walmart for like six bucks and it saved definitely a, probably six or seven days where you know, the arm wasn't feeling too ripe and, and this thing definitely got me right. The next thing is I collabed with um, Airway and I mean, they do a really good job with this. Um, Bader uses it. It's just pretty much a mouthpiece that gets you locked in when you're in at bat or at the gym working out. Um, super cool tool, um, been messing around with it a little bit and I've really liked it so far. Now let's get into some superstition right here. Um, I always got to make sure that I got my good luck charm on here. Um, I got my Roberto Clemente card. It's my favorite baseball player of all time. Um, it's one of the guys who was substituted for my class who turns out to be the origin of called Charleston baseball program. He kind of compared me to him by, by my uh, play style and old school ways. And so um, put me on the path of him and I've just been following him ever since and gave me this baseball card and it's been a lucky charm ever since. And then the second thing I got is a picture of me and my grandma. Um, She's the biggest impact in my life and you know, the, the charm of the family. Um, I miss her so much and just having her by my side every single game uh, means so much to me. And so having it in pictures and having it literally on my side means so much to me. Next thing we got, we got the cleats. These are the gamers, Under Armour. Shout out to Under Armour, man. They do a really good job with all their cleats. Super light, comfortable and reliable. Um, I've been using this pair for about Five or, six, five or six games now, and I mean, they've held up very, very well. I'm very rough on my cleats. Um, I have a pretty big foot, so most of the cleats don't really fit me, and I mean, these just fit me perfectly, and they match the uh, colorway of the school, so shout out to Under Armour. Now we're gonna get in the main compartment. Always gotta make sure I have my Nakona show belt at the very top, just in case, you never know. Maybe a teammate needs it, or you know, maybe my gamer breaks, but I um, always got to have this one on deck for sure. The next thing we got are the gloves. This is my gamer right now. It's a Rawlings, um, part of the hide. I really love the pocket on it. Um, she's broken in very, very well. I've been using it for about two years now. A um, little bit of wear and tear, but man, I've been, I've been loving this glove ever since I got it. And then I got this new one, it's Nakona. Uh, I've been trying to break her in, get her all right, but um, very beautiful glove. It's kind of a Team USA inspired colorway with the, with the red palm. Um, I tried to go with like the red bottoms, but put it onto a glove. So like the, I really, really like the red pocket. I think it looks really clean. And I know, I know dang well in a few years this thing's gonna be the gamer. 
Now we got the helmet. This is the Sunroll helmet, the logo. I got the C flap on it. Um, I can tell you, guaranteed, this helmet will last you a while. This is an Easton. This has been through a lot of headshots with the pitching machine. She's done pretty well, so shout out to Easton for making a really good helmet. So these are the gamers right now. I got the uh, G-Form handguard. Um, I don't, I don't really know what it is about it, but I think it's the, the flexibility about it. I just really like how it fits in my hand. Um, this thing has lasted me for over a year now, so super reliable stuff. And G-Form did a really good job of making this product. Um, now we got the gamer Bruce bolts. These are the Liberty colorway. Dude, these things are so sick. I love these ones. It's kind of like a mint green color um, with a pretty natural palm. And then I always have to keep that thumb pro on there, on that thumb. It saves me a lot of uh, a lot of missed barrels and a lot of hurt hands. So. Next thing we got is a sliding mitt. This is the OG, man. This is, I've had this one for a long time. Um, this, I, this is what I'm talking about with Bruce Bolt's quality. I mean, I've had this for probably two or three years now, and there's just pretty minimal wear and tear on it. And I've slid into a lot of bags and used this plenty of times. So it just goes to show their quality of stuff. And then I've had this Evo Shield forever. I, this is kind of like my lucky charm. Um, I've been using it for about six years now. I've been having it since I was 12. So, you know, this one's had a lot of a lot of games and a lot of home runs and a lot of hits on it. And I'm not ready to switch it up yet. But I got some USA Baseball straps on it. I got it over the summer, and dude, these things this thing's drip right here. I love it. Next thing we got is the backup pair of Bruce Bolts. Um, this one matches my, my team's colorway. It's a green and white with the uh, green bolt. These are super slick. I use these for a while now. Um, again, they just hold up to the test. Bruce, Bruce Bolt stuff is so quality, and I'm so thankful that you know we're working together. So thank you, Bruce Bolt. You thought I was done with the Bruce Bolt stuff, but we got another pair, baby. So these are the, uh, these are the ones I wore during the All-Star game. Um, I gave those ones away, so I had to make sure I got another another pair. Dude, these things are so slick. Um, if your team's colorway is black, I for sure recommend these ones. These ones are so sick. Um, it's pretty much like a mint green um, accents with the with the all black. Um, super slick pair, and pretty much goes with any any single team you play for. Last thing I got in the main compartment is another pair. This is. This is the military green. I'm waiting to rep these ones out um, for a military night at school, but this colorway is so sick, man. I got, my dad picked these ones out. He's 20 years Air Force, so he just fell in love with these ones instantly, but they're so sick. And then I already got the Thumb Pro picked out. It's the neon green, green one, and so, man, this combo's gonna look fire. I can't wait to use it. I appreciate you guys tuning in. This was What's In My Baseball Bag. Thank you guys for checking it out. Have a good one.